This video is strictly for educational purposes only. I do not condone or glorify the use of drugs. What's up, everyone? I'm Loki Fish, and in this video, we're covering the supplement known as Lion's Mane. This is a medicinal mushroom that's been proven to benefit the brain, nerves, and immune system. It's been used as a legal nootropic and has been shown to enhance brain functioning by stimulating the growth of new brain cells and support gut, heart, and immune health. I'll go over anything you'd want to know, including the benefits, side effects, dosage, dangers, how it works for me and other people, and everything else in between. Let's get into it. Lion's mane is a naturally occurring mushroom that's been used for thousands of years by Buddhist monks to enhance their brain power and heighten their ability to focus during meditation. These days, the supplement usually comes in the form of pills or powder, however, it can also be obtained as an actual mushroom. This one in particular is pretty old, so it's probably not good anymore, but I figured I'd show it to you just to give an idea of the size and what it looks like. You can cook the actual mushroom too and saute it or fry it or do whatever. It tends to have the flavor of like fake crab meat. The secret recipe for one crabby patty is... Three teaspoons of lion's mane mushroom. Usually people find it the most convenient to take it in either pills or capsule form, which is usually just the mushroom grinded up into powder and then put in a capsule. The mushroom itself is scientifically known as Hericium arenaceus. This is due to the primary compounds being hericinones and arenacins. Arenacins help your brain produce more nerve growth factor because these molecules easily cross the blood brain barrier to increase the production of neurons. This makes the lion's mane mushroom extremely effective at stimulating NGF, also known as nerve growth factor. Normally NGF is produced in the hippocampus throughout your lifetime and it's essential for the survival of brain cells, especially those that are involved in transmitting touch sensations and retaining memories. It does this by stimulating the repair and creation of nerve cells. Nerve regeneration helps relieve neurodegenerative symptoms such as Alzheimer's disease, dementia, and Parkinson's disease. Once past the blood-brain barrier, lion's mane stimulates enzyme production that release NGF, thus treating and preventing nerve damage in the brain. Stimulating NGF is one of the many benefits that lion's mane yields. Keep in mind though that you won't feel the benefits right away, rather you'll start to notice them after about two to three weeks of taking on a daily basis. Every single day. But once you start the regimen, lion's mane is a powerful catalyst for brain cell regeneration as well as improving memory, cognition, and critical thinking. At the very least, you'll feel a slight boost in mood and mental energy. One of the most interesting benefits of lion's mane is that it can make you more intrigued about life and makes you want to understand more about people in the world around you. In other words, it helps you develop more empathy and curiosity and put your ego to the side. I guess I could be a bit more Empathetic. Additionally, it can help you make better decisions and enhance skills such as problem solving and learning. This is likely due to lion's mane ability of improving neuroplasticity. There are some potential side effects that can happen, but it's important to note that they don't affect everyone. Some of these side effects are abdominal discomfort, nausea, or extremely vivid and intense dreams. In one study done with rats, lion's mane extract was able to promote neuron regrowth after injury. Rats with nerve damage were literally able to walk again after consuming water containing lion's mane extract. The researchers concluded that lion's mane regenerates generates damaged nerve cells. In this case, the reversal was so profound, the rats went from being totally disabled to walking normally again. Praise the Lord! I can walk again! Regarding the dosage, it's typically recommended to take 1,000 milligrams of lion's mane extract on a daily basis. And it may be more beneficial to split the dose into smaller rations and take it twice or even three times a day. For example, you could take 500 milligrams in the morning and then again at night. Or you could split it up into three doses and take 350 milligrams with breakfast, then lunch, then dinner. I find that a good stack of lion's mane is to take it with both a stimulating supplement and a GABA supplement. When I do this, it makes me much more productive, but at the same time, I feel blissful and passionate. It basically makes work that is normally teaching becomes somewhat enjoyable. Although it can be distracting sometimes, I still find it to be a nice combo. An example of this stack would be taking lion's mane with Nupept, which is stimulating, and then with Gabapentin, which is a Gabagic substance. Or another example would be taking it with Modafinil and Caffeine, which are both stimulating, and then with Lyrica, which is another Gabagic substance. I tend to like Lyrica over Gabapentin as it's more bioavailable and more consistent. But if you don't have access to either of those, you can instead take something like l which mildly affects the GABA receptors as well. Nevertheless, lion's mane is a great nootropic that can be used to improve your cognition and critical thinking skills if you take it on a daily basis. It can be added to almost any nootropic stack as that extra bonus, especially if your stack contains a stimulant and a gabagic supplement. Lyrica in particular is a gabagic substance that's used to treat a wide variety of issues including damaged nerves and generalized anxiety disorder. Watch this video next learn everything there is to know about Lyrica aka pre-gabalin. Another thing Lyrica can do is potentiate other drugs if you take them at the same time, thus making things like caffeine, cannabis, and alcohol much more effective and feel way more cleaner. My name is Fish and I stay low-key. Peace out.